talking with Fiala and Godu. Now, last year, you came on later in the season and, and had an excellent performance. You know, I know myself when I was playing, injuries were an opportunity for me to show out. How do you feel you did showing out later in that season? Well, I'm going to start with the fact that I was very nervous. So. <laughs> As a freshman, you know, coming into that uh, unexpected starting position, um, but now my coach, she definitely uh, harbored it. So you stay ready, stay focused, and when my time, when it's time for me to show up, then my time will come. What's up? Um, <laughs> but yeah, I went to kindergarten with him. I should tell you something. Really? Wow. Mm -hmm. okay. I look. That's I see. I, I don't have the same salt and pepper. I get it. Anyway. Y'all yeah, won't look good. <laughs> well, that's it. There it is. I, say, I don't live in your district. I can't vote for you. But anyway, so I'm sorry. Go. You said you were starting out nervous. And yeah. Then... Nah, I think the, the time went by. I just played one more game. I got uh, into the starting rotation a lot more. I started to feel a lot more comfortable with the offense. A lot more comfortable on the floor. My confidence went up. And everything just started to flow a little bit. And with that same confidence, do you feel like going into, you know, the summer program and doing all that? I mean, we call it the offseason, but we know you were working hard, obviously, you know. But going into that, did that give you the opportunity to concentrate maybe on more technique things, more practice things? Um, yeah, for sure, for sure. Any any weaknesses that I saw about game last year, this summer I definitely wanted to uh, work on so I could improve and be an all-around better player than and, and what was something in particular you stand at where you feel like you've made the biggest jump? Uh, definitely the use in both of my hands. Yeah, I was a right-hand finisher a lot last year, so um, I'm trying to uh, be a little more great uh, right work finishing with that hand. So, Coach has talked about this team being a lot more of a threat offensively. Obviously, you know, whether it's UCF, whether it's to TMS or those names with defense, you expect that from the players. Right. But what have you seen in practice for more explosive offense? What would you would you would you what have you seen there that's got more do you feel like you have is this better personnel? You guys shoot the ball better? What, what have you seen in practice that shows more of an offensive push? I say this year, uh, there's a, a higher sense of urgency, especially in transition. Like we we think our defense is our offense. So we trying to get stops and we trying to get something out of those stops. Of course when we have to we'll pull back and set up an offense and Everybody on this team has the ability to score. We're all great scorers, we're all very talented, but we want to go fast. And we've been doing a much better job of that. And you mentioned that speed aspect. I think you and Achal, you know, both being similar type players, you both move well. You know, you, you like to lead that charge. Um, there were times foul trouble was an issue. Have you kind of, yeah, so with that in mind, I mean, you mentioned that comfort. Now that you have kind of that more of that body control, like, do you think an element of that helps this kind of uh, urgency that you're talking about? Absolutely, and I think it came with experience. Like, like I said, me coming into an unexpected starter position um, on the defensive side, it was a lot harder adjusting to going from being able to block everything in high school and going from having to actually move my feet and move my body and show my length. So this year, with practicing that over the summer, it's definitely got better. So I know just this past practice day, everybody did an impression of coach at practice. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'll say this though, with as much as everybody talked to showed her breaking down and doing some, I'm 47, I can do something. I'm 45 and I have trouble, so I get coach props. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, how much does that kind of show there? How much you know defense? Like that's still a good part of the identity of this team. Yeah, her her intensity during practice and her demonstrating what she liked us to do, it definitely gets us going a little bit. Like, you know, I'm 47 and I can still do it. That's like a joke that's carrying on throughout the team. But we know the, the overall message she's trying to get across is that um, defense is about heart. Like, you get down and you cut somebody off, and, and, and that's that. They don't take no skill. They don't take no uh, practice or anything like that. So that's what she wanted to do. Well, they, uh, so here's the hard hitting question. Are you ready for the Big J journalism? Who did the best impression of Coach? Oh, that's me. Oh, you, you wrote it. Not even close. I'm number one. That's why they put me last. I'm the best for last. Come on, man. Flawless <laughs> logic continues. Y'all, we're going to have fun watching this season. It's great talking to you.